Wow! What a mostly kinda whatever showcase Sony had today, huh? It started with the KOTOR remake, uh, actually no, it started with this game of chess. The graphics were pretty nice, but there's no release date yet, so I'm crossing my fingers for July 20th, 2022, which would coincide with International Chess Day. But anyway, back to the KOTOR remake. That was cool. That's all I have to say, I, li I literally have nothing else to add. But then they showed Project Eve! It's a hacker slasher doohickey, and it looks anime as fuck with all these gross enemies. Badass! From there though, it was a long period of just... <sighs> More Wonderland stuff? Uh, no, I don't care. More Forspoken? Oh, you know, that admittedly still looks pretty cool. Um, more Rainbow Six Extraction, which is fine. We got some footage of that Alan Wake remaster, and that was neat. Uh, oh fuck, there's a new GTA- oh no, it's GTA 5 still. And here's more Ghostwire Tokyo, still looks cool, but we've seen it. We've seen enough Guardians of the Galaxy already, just put it out already- IT'S OUT IN A MONTH! That was fast. We've seen Blood Hunt, no thanks. Deathloop, I still want it, it still looks good, but I feel like I'm stuck in a death loop from how many times I've seen this game at every Sony conference. Radiohead made a game, I guess? Well, somebody made a game for Radiohead, is this even a game? I don't know, let's move on. To this absolutely adorable, wholesome looking game where you can possess animals and play guitar and sail. It's called... Oh, it's so cute. Okay, finally, we get to the first party stuff. Let's see some new sh... Oh, fuck, it's Uncharted 4 Remaster. God damn it. I mean, cool, and it's on PC now. That's neat, but... <sighs> Seen it. Uh... I was now 35 minutes into a 40 minute presentation and I was ready to give up on this whole thing. But then, there's an Insomniac logo and a Marvel logo. Obviously I'm thinking this is Spider-Man 2. Until... What the fuck? Insomniac are making a Wolverine game. This is insane. I flipped my goddamn shit this morning. I can't wait to actually see gameplay from this thing. But for now, I'll just watch this teaser over and 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 over again. Then there was Gran Turismo 7. Shiny cars, cool. Ah, and here's Spider-Man 2, as expected. Miles, Peter, fighting dudes. Sounds like Craven talking. He's He's not my favorite Spider-Man villain, but sh- oh, HOLY FUCK IT'S VENOM! I shat, my pants were soiled, thank you Insomniac, for my shitty pants and laundry bill. And then finally, as no surprise to anyone, we got to see God of War Ragnarok, officially God of War Ragnarok, and it looks just as great as I expected it to look. The grappling hooks and the blades and the axe, it all looks so very cool, and I'm looking forward to playing it. And that was it. There was a post show where we learned some little tidbits of info about the first party games they showed, but that was the end of the main show. Overall, I enjoyed the showcase, it started and ended well, which is probably what matters for most people. I just would have liked a couple more things thrown in the middle, you know? To break up all of the stuff we'd already seen the last couple of years, uh, or in some cases, uh, eight years. I'm most looking forward to the Insomniac Marvel games and God of War, but what are you guys looking forward to? Let me know in the comments, and stay bad!